Biden's got big problems in his own family, though. So Ben is going to be talking about this at length today. But this is the, the big shocking scandal of Hunter Biden. This, this is probably the least shocking scandal that Hunter Biden has ever been involved in. But this is the one that's getting a lot of attention now. Hunter Biden used the N-word in a private text. The N-word. Now, how did the N-word become the N-word? You know, this is a word I truly, I cannot say it. You, we all know what I'm referring to, so I don't need to say it. But this word is the only unutterable word in the English language. Plenty of words are discouraged, but this one is unutterable. And that's a fairly new situation. I actually detail how this happened in my upcoming book, Speechless Controlling Words, Controlling Minds, which is available now for pre-order. The New York Times was printing this word until quite recently, actually. But now it won't print this word. It will only print the N-word. Hunter Biden, while texting with his white, very expensive lawyer, said things like, true debt, N-word. Now, you know, there's there are two kinds of N-word. Hard R and soft R. Okay? You know, I don't... <laughs> I can't say it because if I do, I will be banished to the outer darkness where there's wailing and gnashing of teeth. So I can't even say it to dis- describe it to you. But there's there's one that ends in er and there's one that ends in uh. And hun- and uh is a little softer and more colloquial and people use it in a, in a more friendly context. And then the er is decidedly unfriendly. Hunter used the uh. Okay, so he was using, I'm not defending anything that Hunter Biden's ever done for that matter, but he was just using this in a private message. Now, this is, a, this is the unforgivable sin. That's what they're going to get him on? That's what they're going to get him on? No, they, they actually, he won't, he won't face any consequences for this, even though this is supposedly the worst thing he's ever done. The guy has used illicit drugs. The guy cheated on multiple wives, and including then shacking up with his dead brother's widow and then cheating on her with a stripper with whom he had a child that he refuses to acknowledge and that Joe Biden very cruelly refuses to acknowledge. Joe Biden will not acknowledge one of his grandchildren, good old friendly Uncle Joe, right? Oh, sweet old grandpa Joe Biden just will not acknowledge this girl's existence. Can you imagine? You're this little girl. Your grandpa's the president of the United States. He refuses to acknowledge that, that you're alive. All that, no big deal. Then you had the political problems. This guy was taking, that's a personal scandal. The, the political scandal is this guy was shaking down foreign governments and, and taking bribes for political favors from his father. And there's a lot of evidence that his father carried through on some of those favors, notably in Ukraine. But he was also taking money and taking meetings in China for skills that he does not possess and en- enriched himself tremendously this way. Doesn't matter. There are videos of him on the internet right now videos of him with prostitutes overseas doing all sorts of things of very dubious legality from a laptop that was discovered before the election that very few people know anything about because big tech colluded with the liberal state to shut it down. When that story broke about Hunter Biden's laptop, you weren't even allowed to privately message the story because There's one set of standards for some people and one set for another. Hunter Biden says the N-word, he'll be fine. Doesn't matter. If Hunter Biden's not going to get in trouble for taking bribes and selling out the U.S. government, he's not going to get in trouble for saying a word. Now, if you said the N-word, you you would get in trouble. Your life would be ruined. Hunter Biden, completely different. In the spirit of Pride Month, I want you to know, I I am really proud. I know pride goeth before destruction and a haughty spirit before fall. I am proud, though, of this YouTube channel. And all you people who have subscribed, that's so great. If you haven't subscribed yet, ring the bell, subscribe, get the notifications, head on over also to the audio podcast at Apple Podcasts, Google Play, Spotify, Stitcher, I don't know, we're at MySpace, Zanga, LiveJournal. Subscribe there too. Please leave a five-star review. We'll see you next time.